back to my channel. So today I have the third video in the series of the Charlotte Rose easy to put together um, costume looks. And this one, of course, as you guys can tell, is a unicorn, a holographic unicorn that is. So enough of my chit chatting and let's get right into this look. As usual, I'm starting off with my Charlotte Rose Prep In Your Step Priming Spray. The eyeshadows I'll be working with today are from my Aftershock Bad Habit Palette. For this look, you want to use shades that are colorful and shimmery. To prep my eyes, I'm using a jumbo shimmery white pencil to create a base for my eyeshadow. The first shade I'm going to be using is the shimmery teal color and patting that down all over my lid. I'm also applying the same shade to my bottom lash line. In the crease of my eye, I'm applying this bright hot pink shade. I'm also making sure to drag it along the top bridge of my nose. With the yellow shade, I'm blending out the edges of my hot pink shadow and highlighting my brow bow. Next, I'm going in with this purple shade to darken up my crease and apply the same shade to my lower lash line too. I'm also applying some of the hot pink eyeshadow to the center of my lower lid. With a little bit of black eyeshadow, I'm going in to darken up and intensify the purple crease and outer V corner. Once again, I'm going to go back in with the teal eyeshadow and reapply it to the center of my lids to intensify it and touch it up a bit. I'm also applying some of it to the inner corner of my eye. Then with a bright shimmery white eyeliner, I'm lining my bottom waterline. And with black eyeliner, I'm tight lining my top lash line. And as usual, I'm applying falsies and blending them in with my Charlotte Ruse's Lashes at Length Mascara. Now to conceal and apply foundation as usual. To set everything in, I'm using my Charlotte Ruse Universal Mattifying Pressed Powder. And of course, I can't forget my brows, so I quickly fill those in too. For my cheeks, I'm using my Charlotte Ruse Cheek Tint Make Him Blush for a rosy and dewy finish. And right over that, I'm applying a purple tinted highlighter. For my lips, I'm using my Charlotte Ruse Velvet Lip Dip in Soulmate. And right over that, I'm applying a shimmery lip gloss that gives you all the unicorn feels. Now this look wouldn't be complete without some rhinestones, and I'm using these pre-made face jewels because it makes it so much easier. For my hair, I'm popping them up into two messy space buns and putting on this DIY unicorn headband. These cute earrings from Charlotte Ruse go perfectly with my unicorn look. My necklace is also from Charlotte Ruse. For my outfit, I grabbed this holographic V-neck romper and paired it with this metallic jacket and pink shimmery boots. Everything I'm wearing is also from Charlotte Ruse. And this is your complete holographic unicorn look. Thanks so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and this three-part series. I know I had a lot of fun, especially with this one. This is definitely my hands down my favorite look of them all because it's super pretty and glittery and I love glitter and I love sparkle and I love holographic looks. So this was fun to create and make. Um, if you did like it, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, share it with your grandma, it helps the girl out. Also, don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell so you get notifications every time I upload a new video. And yeah, so we can keep this conversation going and this community growing. I love you guys so much. Remember that you're absolutely beautiful and until next time, bye. Mwah.